Hi everyone, I'm sure just like me you're all excited to get right into RPG Maker MZ and if you bought any DLC then today's video is just going to explain exactly how you can install that DLC. Now firstly what you want to do is figure out where your Steam files are because that's where your DLC is located. So what you want to do is go over to Steam then you want to right click on your RPG Maker MZ and go properties and then under all these tabs you want to find local files and then browse local files. Once you've clicked browse local files this is going to be the RPG Maker MZ file that it opens up. You just want to click on DLC and in here is all the DLCs that you've purchased. I purchased the entire bundle so I can show it off to you guys and we're just going to start with the MZ cover art characters pack. So if we click up the top here on the far right of all these words that there is the file location. So we're going to hit Control C and copy that. We're going to jump back over to RPG Maker MZ. We're going to go into our resource file. And this is where you're going to start importing all your different DLCs. So if we want to import the faces, what we'll do is we'll hit Image, Faces, then we'll go Import. And then right up here, we're going to click there and hit Control V and then Enter. And that's going to take us to our DLC folder. Then we'll click on Faces, select the two, open them up. Now as you can see we've got the faces installed in our files. It's the same with your background music and anything like that you just hit import control V and then you'll see the audio over here BGM highlight all of those and click into it and now as you can see if we scroll down all the new DLC themes have been installed into this file. Same thing with pictures click on it import click up here control V go to the file pictures and then you can highlight all of these and import them all into your game file. Next we're going to install all of the plugins so what you want to do is find your plugins folder. Again we can go over to Steam and browse our local files. It'll be in DLC, basic resources and plugins. You've got two different files, you've got the official file and you've got the launch file with all of the different plugins that have been released with MZ. You just want to highlight everything here hit Control c to copy it and then you want to paste it over in your game file. So I'm over in my game file here, you just want to open up the JavaScript file and then plugins and then hit Control v to copy all of those in there. Now if we go back into our game and look into our plugin manager which is this button right here, double click there, you'll see all of the different plugins that we've just installed into this game. That is how you install your plugins and DLC into your brand new RPG Maker MZ game. Jump over to the next video, there'll be a card to the left, and we're going to go over my DLC review for the Cover Art Characters Pack. Let's go!